This is why this video is all about. But anyway, what's good, you two? This is Madam Me, and I want to talk about losing weight. I've been talking about losing weight since what September of last year. I went to the gym in September and October, and then I went off for work and I stopped going and I canceled my membership. Yes, I did. But. I ain't been saying I want to lose weight all this year. I tried that little diet tea. All it did, it made me duke duke. Sorry, I shouldn't have said that. But yeah, I tried that. I stopped eating out. Let go of sweets and get sweets again. Then I be like, got that happy weight. I got the depressed weight. Like I was saying, I got the depression weight from, you know, that post graduation. What is postgraduate? When you can't find a job right after you graduate, yeah, I have that that weight. That is real. You get real depressed and you eat. You get depressed and you eat depressed and we be in a dark spot. But I ain't talking about it right now. But I think I want to lose weight. But I'm scared. I'm be honest. I'm scared. And people might say, "Why are you scared?" I'm scared. Because I don't want nobody to look at me when I'm trying to lose weight. That's the untruth. I don't want nobody to watch me as I lose weight. That's why I want to go to the gym. That's the main reason why I don't want to go to the gym. I don't want nobody looking at me. That's crazy. I know. And then this girl said the exact same thing on Facebook. Like She said, you're saying what I've been thinking in my head. It's in my mindset. Like, I'm scared. I don't want nobody looking at me. Then my boyfriend say he'll, you know, work out with me. I don't want him to work out with me. I don't. I'm scared to work out around him. It's just a mind thing, I guess. I don't want to do it. If he's around or if they're around. Like, I was right. I bought a bike. I was riding my bike. But when I see people outside, I'm like, yeah, it's time to go back in the house. So I guess I got to get out there mindset in order to lose weight so if you want to lose weight with me let's do it together please please like i wish i had the same confidence i had when i was 12 y'all like i lost a lot of weight when some before my middle school i was outside in the after in the morning the afternoon i walked i did I was on my trampoline and I didn't care about doing thing nobody said. But now I need that same mentality and I don't know why. And then I wanted to go to the gym at my apartment, but my apartment charged you thirty dollars. And then I paid it and my key didn't work. So that was a no go to. So if I get planet fitness, I don't know if I'll be committed. That's my issue too. Like, I don't want to spend money, and I may not go, because I did that for my work one, like I was going, and then I started wasting my money. I don't want that to happen. So, so I'm like, can I use the resources around me? I should walk. I see a lot of people now in my apartment complex, they're walking. Should I walk too? And they can be my friends. Maybe they can become my friends and motivate me to walk with them, but... They don't want to talk to me. I got to get out of this mindset. Yeah, I got to get out of this mindset. There's a part up the road for me. And then there's a, like another little walking trail. I did that one time. I need to go back. 
It's all the mindset. I got to just get out of the mindset I'm in, and then I can do it. It's a walking trail. It's a park. These all free. And my apartment complete. These are free resources that I should use in, like, about 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. And then I've been asking people to walk. I mean, people asking me to walk. But we haven't made this step. Like, somebody got made the step, so. <sighs> I don't like my thighs on my arm, so they need to go. I want to set a goal, but I don't know. Because I'd be upset if I don't meet that goal. Yeah. Maybe I need a walking buddy for real. And we do it together. And people like eat. <laughs> I got friends who on this fitness journey, they doing well, baby. They doing well, but I am hmm, not trying to do it like them. Like, I don't want to eat healthy. I'll eat a little, change my portions, and I won't starve myself. I've done that. I'm the biggest I ever been, so it has to go. Like, I look at that scale, I'm like, I ain't never seen any numbers. It's, it gotta go. It's all in my thighs and my arm, and it has to go away. So I'm gonna quit complaining, <laughs> quit whining, and get on this journey. So if you want to get on this journey with me, please join me. And when I was in Seattle, I had lost the face, you know, the fat in my face because I, and then, you know, I was walking. I walked everywhere. Every weekend, we walked somewhere. I just didn't do that hiking with my Seattle friends. But I would. I didn't. They had me trying all these different foods, like weird foods, and I didn't try all of them. So, you know, my face was smaller and everything. So, I need to get more active. That's my issue. I need to get more active. So, that's what I will do. I just want to fit back in my old pants. <laughs> That's all I want to do. Fit back my pants. It go at a smaller size, I guess. Because I'm just squeezing myself in the pain, baby. It has to stop. It has to go. It has to stop. Some, some new improve. It's my mindset. If I get my mind in order, I'll be better. I'll be watching YouTube videos of different vloggers about their little uh, weight loss journey. Someone say how they feel. So it's just a trial and error. You just got to stick to it. So that's what I guess I got to do. Find out what's best for me and not worry about what other people are doing. That's my issue to worry about what other folks are doing. How they did it so quick. How they maintain it. I got to do what I can do. So like, comment, and subscribe. Madam Nia's out. Bye.